when I first started in video production, I must have looked at every YouTube channel that I could find. But I wasn't looking for the thing that you were thinking of. I wasn't looking at what camera I should have, what mic I should have, what lighting I should use. I wasn't looking at that. I was looking at two things. I was looking at storytelling and I was looking at business. Those are the two things that I was looking at. Because it didn't matter what camera I used. It didn't matter what mic I used. Now, some, as content creators, may think, well, of course it does, because you want to look professional. And that is true. But you can look professional. When you think about movies that were made 30, 40 years ago, they didn't have the cameras that we have now, yet how impactful they are. Look at 2001 Space Odyssey. Look at uh, Star Wars and all its intricacies of, of what they tried to do to create these ships. So I was looking at the business side of it and I was looking for the storytelling aspect. Now, one of my favorite directors of all time is Steven Spielberg. Now, ask yourself this question. If Steven Spielberg was given a Canon power shot, would his movie still be successful? If you had given him any camera, would he still be able to do this, have the same result? Well, he started filming when he was very young. As soon as he could get his hands on any camera, that's what he did. So really, it was his ability to storytell. And then what happened is the cameras came. The cameras would then increase. He would get a better camera, and then a better camera, and then a better camera after that. It was because of his ability to tell a remarkable story, to frame correctly, and to really get the essence of what they were trying to do. So as a content creator, your job is to tell stories. Tell your stories or tell other people's stories. So really, focus on the business side of it, Focus on the storytelling aspect of it. Um, all editors need to know how to tell stories. Uh, anybody that has content that they want to get out there, you have to learn the essence of storytelling. When you're watching a movie and you see a specific scene, what is it doing to you that emotionally draws you in? Because that's really what triggers the desire and the needs of those that you're trying to reach. It's the emotional element. It's the, their desire to, you know, when you watch a movie, you're trying to escape. And when you watch a video, when you watch your content, they're trying to escape some form of their life so that they can improve and get better because what they see on your side of the camera is something they aspire for. So that's the, uh, what you can do when curating your content. But don't focus on the camera that you're using. So we've heard this before. The best tool you have is the one that you have right now. The, the iPhone, you can get just as good of a story. Focus on the story. Don't focus on the tool, the mic, the lighting. Focus on reaching with your audience. That's the only thing that matters. And that's the thing. And then everything else will come in the future. But if you've got a terrible story and you can't tell it, nobody's gonna wanna listen, even if you have the best camera in the world.